we are, the cast of Best of Enemies, take two. We are back here in Pittsfield, Massachusetts at the Barrington stage. And we just finished um, day two of rehearsals, which honestly feels like hour three. Um, we'll probably be opening in about five minutes, um, which translates to really a few days. We'll be opening on Tuesday, but right now we have just been trying to dig our brains, the recesses of our brains to remember all of our lines. And we're bringing in the fabulous Don Guillory, who showed up on set with all his lines and our lines memorized. <laughs> So now he's calling us to task, and it's been awesome. Uh, well, first thing Julie did uh, was we had a run a read through uh, around the table uh, of the whole play, and then uh, before we could uh, even close the scripts, we were jumping up on the stage because the stage was rebuilt, remounted as soon as the game went down. They put Best of Enemies back up, so Don and all of us were. Not we, we didn't do any of that table work stuff that you usually do. Uh, uh, that happened on our feet, or Don, mostly for Don on his feet. Uh, we were staging immediately um, uh, on the first day. It was extremely challenging, um, of course, for us working with such great actors and artists who I respect greatly. But the show itself is intense and has energy and moves and has extreme motivation. And to come in and try to match that energy and be there, and they're there, it, it is challenging. But I, I welcome the challenge, and it, I like it. I, I like it a lot. I like being here. So, yeah, that's what it is. It's just very challenging. Uh, it's thrilling to do the show again because so many people didn't get to see it. I mean, everybody that you talk to in town, from the restaurants to the coffee shops, say, we're so glad it's a remount because we didn't get because it was selling so well they didn't get to see it and also to get to do it with Don it's really like doing a you know a new version of it it's so invigorating and we're thrilled to have him part of this it's wonderful for a young person to see uh, the attempt at coming together of two different sides uh, basically because of the political climate of, of America at the moment and how fractured it is and I just that really appealed to me in the writing of the play, just alone. Just, you can come together and you can agree, you know, and you're not losing yourself if you agree or find some kind of compromise. I think that's important. I think it's important. 